Chicago police is investigating claims that multiple Chicago police officers engaged in sexual misconduct with migrants sheltering at a police station on the city's west side. Citing law enforcement sources, the Chicago Sun-Times reports that one officer is accused of, quote, impregnating a teenage girl, while multiple colleagues are also accused of additional sexual misconduct. Chicago is one of many U.S. cities struggling to accommodate thousands of migrants being bused from the Texas-Mexican border. For the past few months, the city has used its police stations to house new arrivals before transferring them to shelters. Chicago police confirmed to Scripps News that the allegations are under investigation by two agencies. One of them, the Civilian Office of Police Accountability, says that while investigators are currently determining whether the facts are substantiated, we want to assure the public that all allegations of this nature are of the highest priority. In a video statement, the president of the local police union calls the allegations baseless. Stop the rumors until there's some validity to the complaint. It is just that, a bunch of BS. Migrant advocates and volunteers have long complained that police stations are inadequate shelters. When Scripps News recently visited one of them, a volunteer called the conditions untenable. They're really in a very small, tight space with heat really blowing to kind of hold the, the building heat in. Um, so they're particularly poor conditions. As for Chicago Mayor Brendan Johnson, he tells Scripps News that his administration remains intensely focused on the deeply troubling allegations and that the city is in the process of fully relocating all migrants who stayed at the police station where officers are being investigated. City officials also tell me that they are working around the clock to move all migrants at all police stations, not just the one right behind me. As for volunteers, they tell me what they want to see now is a high-quality sexual violence prevention strategy, including know your rights sessions for all the asylum seekers. Ben, I know you recently visited one of these police stations that's been housing migrants and also you've been reporting on migrants in Chicago for such a long time. Can you help us understand what that environment is like for these asylum seekers? So the one station that I visited a couple months ago, it's not the one behind us, but it's not far away. And it was kind of surreal. Anyone who wanted to step inside the station almost had to be careful not to trip on the migrants who were sleeping inside the tiny entryway. But at the same time, the migrants sleeping there told me that they were grateful, uh, those migrants at least, they were grateful to the city, they were grateful to police officers for the way that they felt they were being treated. Uh, but there is no doubt that today the, the city of Chicago is under immense pressure to find an alternative to police stations uh, as shelter for migrants. Ben Chimiso reporting from Chicago. Thank you very much.